After the craziness that was in the previous part, we press on. This is actually part 8 of Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. And before I continue, I want to say this. I've decided that I'm not going to make the videos go too long. Ex unless necessary. Besides, I really don't want to bore you too much because, yeah, much of my playthrough will be unedited for obvious reasons. And we're pretty much beat, so now we need to rest. Alright, now we're back on our feet. This time, we're ready. Ranked match. Rank 10, the Iron and Dottis Twins. Be sure to use a partner skill at least once. Alright, this time, we're doing it right. We're bringing in Yoshi along for the ride. Trust me, he's going to be used. <laughs> Time for us to head to the Major Leagues. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Armored Harriers. Yep, a fight at a finish with the Iron Adonis Twins. Let me at him. Yeah, bring it. Ready for a beating? These ultra hard pods just can't lose. Get yourselves ready to battle. Yeah, this time, we don't need to do much. Gonzalez, let me at him. We're going to take these punks this time. <laughs> Stick one's challenging us again. He never learns. Looks like he brought some new shrimpy partner. As if that's gonna help him. No sweat. Besides, we know just the thing. Press C R. Yeah, that's stylish. Ouch! You spiked me right in the. That really hurt. Our iron bodies and pointed nastiness are being used against us. No fair. Oh, dang, bro. Have you discovered our weak points? Defend. Don't worry, my friend. You'll be fine. There you go. You're done. That's what you get. Do we have to go back to the minor league loud now, bro? I think I'm gonna be sick. Congratulations, Great Gonzalez! With this win, you made the major league. Now that, folks, was what I call a wild and wooly fight. A diggity dang doozy. Keep it up, kid. You're going places I can tell. Woo wee. Come on now, folks. Give it up. We got a new major leaguer. Let's hear it for him. Here's your fight money of 14 coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. And Mr. Gonzalez, Mr. Grubba wishes to see you in his office. Follow me. Mr. Grubba, I brought Mr. Gonzalez as you requested. Miss Jolene, you mind your manners now. We not around here, Missy. I apologize, Mr. Grubba. Don't you worry your pretty little head about it, none. Now, what I want again? Something about Gonzalez? Oh, yeah. Gonzalez, you all so-and-so. Let me congratulate you, son. Major League already, huh? I had a feeling you were going places in 
Dang, I love it when I'm right. You just keep on putting toothbrushes in them seats. I'm counting on you, son. I got a special little something something for you. Go on, take. 30 coins. So yeah, something else has been on my mind. Your costume ain't cool. No big deal, son, but hey, someday if you become champ, I'll get you a new one. Something hot pink, maybe with some frills or something. You'll look a sight, son. Anyway, that's something for another day, pod. Take a powder, okay? Mr. Gonzalez, please follow me if you would. Now we reach the major leagues. This is the major league locker room. You will use this room from this moment on. The match system is the same as the minor league, but the bouts are hard. Try not to get completely destroyed out there, okay, Mr. Gonzalez? Well, if you'll excuse me, I must be going now. What's the deal? Would he kill these guys to show a little friendliness? Sheesh! Studdly guy coming through. Listen up, losers. I've been hearing about hearing about some rising star tearing up the league. It's you, isn't it? Yeah, you fit the bell, skinny. A mustache named Gonzalez. Man, I came all the way out over here for you. <laughs> what a waste of time. What's your deal, Gonzalez? Huh? Oh, the champ's belt. What in the... Hey, you! Get too close to the hawk and you might get rocked. I love Yoshi's expression in this scene. <laughs> it's so funny. I'm not sure, but it definitely looks weird. I think you're right, Gonzalez. Fake. Hey, you think you can just smack talk the rock hawk? I don't think so. You got some guts calling my belt a fake, you shrimpy no belt having wimps. Didn't your mama teach you any manners? Whoa, sorry, yellow dude. I didn't mean to rip on your big bad belt. Stop making fun of me, punk. You're alive only because we ain't in the ring right now. If I see you under those lights, I'll tear you apart. Remember, The Rock. He has the ego the size of Dwayne Johnson. Wow, I really pushed that dude's buttons, huh? Well, forget him. We got a problem. Your map pointed to Glitzville, right? If that dude's belt has a fake crystal star on it, then where the heck is the real one at? <laughs> Gonzalez, is that your mailbox XP going off? Where'd you get an email from? And why do I hear the theme of Iceland from Super Mario Bros. 3? If you want the crystal star, heed my instructions from X. Who the heck is this X dude? Sounds like he's the man to see about that crystal star. Why would he want to help us out, though? The whole deal seems kind of whack. Gonzalez, even if the belt's a fake, I think we should try to take the championship anyway. It's the best way to find out what's really going on here in the glitz pit. He's right. Now let's get ourselves rested up. Now we're in the major bed. And don't worry, once you sleep in there the first time, you just press the start button to skip it. All right, now everyone's rejuvenated. Yeah, now you have four allies. Okay, so now let's see what's our rank system now. We're in the major leagues now, so we gotta work for it. Well, boy, howdy! Fixing for a fight. Okay, then your next opponent will be in rank nine, the Tiny Spinies. Now listen, son, in this battle, I want you to win before you, before you take 20 HP of pain. Our fans don't want to see a battered hero win by the skin of his teeth, son. Now get in there and show me some grit, pard. So we're gonna have to strike hard then. <laughs> Mr. Gonzalez, it's time for your next match. Come with me. We just gotta at least reach rank 6. For our next battle, we got the merciless executioner, the great Gonzalez, and the thorny demons. Yup, a fight of the finish with the tiny spideys. We aren't gonna lose the likes of you. 
And before I continue in the GameCube version, she calls them scrubs. Don't take my word for it. Watch my playthrough and you'll know for yourself. Wee, it's gonna be fun poking fun at you. Get yourselves ready to battle! Win before taking 20 HP of damage. Okay. Time for an anal analyze. Yes, Goombella, you're the best party member, hands down. That's a red spike top. It's the most well protected of the Buzzy Beetle species. Max HP 5, attack 3, and defense is a whopping 4! Yep, this guy is hard. It has really high defense, and fire and explosions don't hurt at all. If we could just find a way to flip it over, its underside has defense of 0. And that spike? What a pain. There's gotta be a way to flip it over. Lucky for us. We have just the job. Okay, we got the analysis. Yoshi, please do what you do best. Gulp it down. Yeah, get wrecked. Oh, that means you gotta win before you take 20 HP of damage. That's why. Okay. We got ourselves a winner, the Great Gonzalez. <laughs> now that's more taste. Here's your fight money of 15 coins. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Oh, that's good. Alright, let's see what's our next opponent today. Okay, then. Your next opponent will be ranked 8, the Poker Faces. Now listen, son. In this battle, I want you to wrap it up in five turns or less. I got a date with my best girl and just a few, and I don't want to be here. Now get in there and bring this puppy on quick. Thankful. Our match is coming up. You ready to throw it out? Heck yes to that. <laughs> Alright, it's time for the next match. Yeah... No, let me see my gear. Alright, let's go. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Ultimate Weapons. Yep, a fight at the finish with the Poker Faces. Come on, Mario, let's get this over with. <laughs> You're gonna be coleslaw, kid, and that ain't good. <laughs> Get yourselves ready to battle! We gotta beat this in five turns. Oh, these guys. No, no, no. Should I use Yoshi to swallow? Yeah, let's see if we can. Nope, we can't. We can't use our regular tactics. We'll just use this! And that's for hurting my friend, Bozo. What a pain. We got ourselves a winner! <laughs> How that floor taste? Real good, doesn't it? Here's your fight money of 16 coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Gonzalez, you hear that? You just got another email. See what it is. Go to the watering hole outside the glitz pit. 
It's from our Mystery X2. Go to some watering hole, huh? Okay, whatever. I get anything to know who this dude is. Well, we're already in rank eight, so. That's the minor league entrance. All right, let's find that watering hole. Maybe we'll find some answers. It says watering hole outside the Glitzburg. Wow. I could use a couple extra coins, so I'll just bet on Rock Hawk again. Hey, what's shaking, dude? Keep it clean out there, okay? Prince Mush always did. Oh, you're Mr. Gonzalez. Yeah, that's the mustache I've been waiting for. Actually, you're pretty late. Somebody left a package and I know by the door better go. It said, look for a this dash man in Gonzalez and give him this. And this is this. We obtain the Super Hammer. Ah, sup, Toadette. Hey, it's me again, Toadette. So nice to see you again. Congratulations on getting that Super Hammer. Now you can use a wicked cool new technique. Let's get to practicing it. It's a little hard, but I'm sure you'll get it. Hold down B and rotate the left analog stick until your body twists up. Then release B to perform your Super Hammer technique. The key is to rotate a lot before releasing the B button. A hammer spin. Oh, excellent. You're so awesome. You clear? Okay, great. You've mastered the super hammer. With the super hammer move, you can break even big blocks like this. Oh, gee, I almost forgot. You can use the super hammer in battle. Plus, your hammer attack power is boosted now. I'll see you later, Mario. Good luck with your quest. So far as I can tell, the hammer's a new model. The Hammer Whack 2005. Real nice hammer all around. Solid craftsmanship, good grip, high park ability. The commercial for this thing said that the hammer chooses its user. They aren't cheap either, so whoever gave us to you must be a big fan. But why leave it in this juice shop? Isn't this odd? I mean, it's not as hard to hand a gift to a pro fighter. Now what? You can sell us! Email time! Smash the blockade in the locker room. The blockade in the locker room, huh? Wonder what's behind it. Yeah, I think I know what we need to do. Now that we have the super hammer, this is gonna help us out. Wait, what are you doing here? Hey there, Gonzalez. How's it going? Me? I'm doing a little research. Hey, speaking of which, ever heard of the Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit? Yes, this place has rumors and secrets in spades, but the Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit are the most mysterious of the bunch. These things fascinate me, so I wander around doing research on them. Well, so how about it? Want to hear about it or not? The sealed wall, the man-eating toilet, the stairs of mystery, the Haunted Boudoir, The Spooky Ring Lights, The Missing Ones, and Grubba and Jolene. Interesting. You know, it's possible that the Seven Wonders are just gossip and rumors. But I've got to tell you, I think they're real. And I think they're sketchy. I smell a rat behind all this, and someday I'll solve all these mysteries. If you ever hear more about this stuff, just say the word, okay? <laughs> ah, Gonzalez, isn't it? I got word that you somehow fell back down the minor league game. Can't say I understand why, anyway, go on in. Your mind will leave again? That doesn't make any sense! Ah, oh, these guys. Well, well.
we gain dubious documents. A set of documents that go into detail about a lot of important stuff. Whoa, Gonzalez, that's some, some kind of scientific paper on the crystal stars. Who'd be investigating those things besides us? They even took pictures. The bell was fake, but the real stars got in here somewhere. Who needs something like this lying around? This is reeks of funny business. You again. Mr. Gonzalez, what are you doing in here? This is the minor league locker room. Major league athletes are forbidden. Even if they weren't, it's hardly appropriate to bash down our walls. Hmm. I'll just be confiscating this, thank you very much. Dang, what's weather? We busted our humps getting that information. Some people just gotta rain on parades. Well, at least we know the Crystal Star's here. Okay, time to head back to the Major Leagues. We got stuff to win. Ranked match. Well, boy, howdy. Okay, then, your next opponent will be rank 7, the Shell Shockers. Now, listen, son, in this battle, I want you to be sure to use a partner skill at least twice. The crowd loves a tag team, and they want to see your partner show their stuff, too. Now, get in there and put your partner to work. You gotta do it twice. <laughs> okay, so I think I'll use Goombella for one. And then have Yoshi do the other. Let's do it. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Turtles of Hurdle. Yup, a fight for the finish with the Shell Shockers. Come on, Mario, let's get this over with. So-called Great Gonzalez, don't think I'm going to take it easy on you, baby. Get yourselves ready to battle! Use your partner's skill at least twice. That's a shady Koopa. It's yet another member of the Koopa family tree. Max HP 8, attack 3, defense 1. The difference between them and other Koopas, they can attack from their backs. That's not all. While on their backs, their attack gets boosted and they use a terrifying technique. Wow, that's pretty tricky. No wonder they're called Shady Koopas, huh? Fine. Now that's stylish. Boosted defense by three. That's all right, we'll just use Super Hammer. Requirements complete. That's a Shady Paratrooper. It's a Shady Koopa with wings, obviously. Max HP 8, attack 3, and defense is 1. Knock off its wings and it's a Shady Koopa. Unlike typical Koopas and Paratroopas, the its attack jumps while it flips up off its back. This also says that as a movement hits you and your partner at once. Is that possible? Uh, I guess the best thing to do is just beat it quickly after we flip. Super guard. Now. Yeah, don't bother us. Okay, Yoshi. Now oh, that's all right. We'll use a turn. Nuts. 
Wait, what are you doing? Ah, nice work. Bingo time. Damn it. I got lucky. What to do? Fine, Earth Tremor. Yeah, you're done, bozos. Let's kick it up to full power. That's how it's done. We got lucky. Those a winner, the Great Gonzalez. That all you got, Gonzalez? Whoa, Nelly! I don't believe my eyes, folks. The Iron Adonis twins are in a rage. You made us look like suckers the other day, and now you're gonna pay for it. A uh, little tired from your match, Great Stick? What? Too bad. Prepare for pain. These guys never learn. Yeah, and they don't give us time to attack, relax at all. Fine. Sweet treat. I don't have a choice now. Damn it. Oh, that can do. That can do us nicely. Let's gulp these bozos down. Yep, thanks to guard. Gulp it down. Do you like go away now? We're done with you. You should have waited till we were fully rested. We lost after all that. We reek. Woo wee! That's our great Gonzalez friends and neighbors. They don't even blink when the Iron Adonis twins barge in an attack. Woo! Tough. He's too dang tough. Yeah, this kid's only bound for bigger things, folks. Until next time, everyone. See ya. Here's your fight money of 17 coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Gonzalez, another email? What now? Keep sticking your nose in where it doesn't belong, and you are D E A D M E A T. Man, that dude sounds pee. I'm thinking that isn't our ex buddy. Who do you think would send something like that? I don't know. But what I will say is this we need to rest up and fast. 
good. Now let's set the next one. Well, boy, howdy! Your next opponent will be rank six, the Fuzz. Now listen, son, in this battle, I want you to avoid using any of them there flower points. Yeah, you heard me. Let's see how you do without none of them fancy pants moves. Now get there and show me something, son. The Fuzz? Then I'll just rely on my skill. Yep. For our next battle, we got our merciless execution of the great Gonzalez and the bottomless vacuums. Yep, a fight of the finish with the fuzz. We are gonna lose the likes of you. York, York, we'll suck up your souls, York. Get yourselves ready to battle! Fuzzies. It's always gotta be the fuzzies. Thankfully, thankfully her ability doesn't consume FP at all. That's a green fuzzy. As you can see, it's a fuzzy and it's green. Duh. Max HP is 5, attack 3, defense 0. This is similar to a normal fuzzy, so it replenishes its own HP as it sucks out ours. Ew, that is just the grossest thing ever. If you don't find that idea gross, seriously, there's something wrong with you. The main difference between this is that this one multiplies. You know, I bet this thing would look great sitting next to a gold fuzzy. Fission. And it takes out FB, huh? Let's take out the fuzzy then. Yeah, you wanna play you wanna play fission? We can do that. Yikes! Yeah, let's see a try to do with a zap at each zap zap. There. Now let's analyze the other fuzzy. The pink fuzzy. That's a flower fuzzy. Wow, what a totally pretty fuzzy, don't you think? Max HP 6, attack 3, defense 0. This thing attacks by bringing and sucking out FP. How uncool, we need FP. Once it charges up its own, it uses magical attacks. Better beat it before it does. Oh, I just got it. It's a flower fuzzy because it sucks your flower plants. Duh. <laughs> Yeah, don't even think about smacking me with that. Nope. Yeah, keep dividing. We're just gonna kick your butt all the same. Plus, it'll give me more experience faster. Wah, wah. Yeah, that did it. Nuts. That's more like it. Oh good, keep splitting apart. It's gonna make it easier. Fine, we're gonna take it down the old-fashioned way.
Yeah, goodbye. Yeah, that is a lot of experience we just got from this one fight alone. Thirty-five experience. If you really know what you're doing, you could basically have him continuously multiply again and again. We got ourselves a winner, the Great Gonzalez. What do you expect, huh? We rock. Here's your fight money of 18 coins. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Hey, you, Gonzalez, you only brought you a piece of cake. I'm a fan, I guess. That looks so totally yummy. If you chow that, you can ride the sugar rush. Yeah, let's see. Alright. Wait, not yet. Wait one minute. Let's restock first before we press on. Besides, we need to head to the shop and stock up on items. Well, we did fully recover, thank you. Nice, we could just stock up on... Yeah, let's sell off what we don't need. Yeah, I'm here to sell. We don't need these. That should do it. <laughs> they have the point swap. <laughs> I'm gonna stock up on four of these. Let's also hold on to an air earthquake. An earthquake, a rappel cave, and a power punch. And let's add a thunderbolt for good measure. Nice, 20 points, we get an ice storm. That's gonna help. All right, that should do it. Alright, time to get started. We're all set, let's move. Your next opponent will be rank 5, the Magic Koopa Masters. In this battle, one you avoid using any items. Empty them pockets. Real men don't eat drinks now, but I'm out at a proper whoop. Now get in there and knock some out the old fashioned way. Fine by us. All right, let's go. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Underworld Servants. Yep, a fight at the finish with the Magic Koopa Masters. 
we are going to lose to the likes of you. You fool! Would do well to fear our dark magic. <laughs> Get yourselves ready to battle! Can't use items for this fight. Good enough. Let's analyze each of them. That's a red magic Koopa. It's a Koopa wizard dressed in red. Max HP 7, attack 4, defense 0. Besides using offensive magic, it can also use magic to boost attack and defense. When it's alone, the wizard will use magic to multiply. The fact that you can't tell which is the real one after it multiplies is super annoying. I have to say though, the shade of red is definitely not its color. Let's give it a spin jump. It hits for four damage. Okay, analyze the others. Not bad. That's a white magic Koopa. It's a Koopa wizard dressed in white. Max HP 7, attack 4, defense 0. It attacks with magic and can replenish its allies' HP. Better hit it first. Oh, this also said to use magic to make copies of itself when it's all alone. Which is totally annoying because then you can't tell the real deal from the copy. Fine, analyze for the last time. That's a green magic Koopa, a wizard dressed in green. Max HP 7, attack 4, defense 0. It has magic attacks and can also use magic to make itself for allies electrified or invisible. Oh, this also says it'll use magic to make copies of itself, which is totally annoying because then you can't tell the real deal. Then it can't tell, huh? Fine, let's add a tremor. Yeah, let's see how you like this. So much for your illusionary tactics. Get wrecked. Huh, we rock. <laughs> Mario! The hell? Whoa, another fight is storming and screaming his full head off about something. Gonzalez has lots of foes, folks. Some who don't even know his name. Will he live? <laughs> Word on the street was that some mustache doofus was in Glitzville. And looky here. Talk about perfect timing, and now all these folks get to watch me brutalize you! You gotta be kidding me, Bowser? Now? <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I am gonna destroy you, and I have witnesses. Thankfully, I don't have to worry about the rules now. Get yourself fully healed. We need you for this, Mario. Analysis. That's Bowser. But what's he doing here? My mind just full of fuse. Max HP is 30, attack 3, and defense 1. He's uglier than I expected. He's got a poisonous bite, so watch out. It'll make your HP decrease gradually. Also, if he ground pounds you, you won't be able to use one of your commands. Just focus your attention on beating him down. No sweat. We just have to fight. And that's exactly what we're gonna do. Piercing blow! Poisoned! Or is All right, not bad. But I think we're gonna need coops for this. Yeah, you stomped us, but we didn't take the full damage. Okay, time to do something I never really think I would end up doing. Shell Shield! That'll do! That'll do us nicely. from you, Mario. Figures you get some licks in. Damn you! Dude, stop picking on my friend. Almost got him. Don't worry, buddy. This fight's over. <laughs> Get wrecked, Bowser. That battle was over. Alright. Okay, now we're gonna start raising up the HP up to 20. <laughs> Mario became a B-list star. Next battle, Mario's crowd and stage will get bigger. some fool ambushes him. Tough. You're too tough, Snuff, and you're only gonna get tougher. Stay tuned, folks. Until next time, everyone. See ya! Here's your fight money of 19 coins, Gonzalez.
Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Um, was that King Bowser? What was he doing here? That kind of freaks me out. You're right. Let's do one more and we'll end it there. Next opponent will be rank four, Crawdaddy. In this battle, I want you at least one special move, okay? The crowd needs something flashy. You catch my grip? Give him a good shot. Now get in there and blow the roof off, son. <laughs> Mr. Gonzalez, it's time for your next match. Come with me. This guy. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Dark Cave Keeper. Yep, I'll fight it, I'll finish with Crawdaddy. Come on, Mario, let's get this over with. Foolish mortals, I will drag you through the gate to the netherworld. Get yourselves ready to battle! Use a special move at least once. All right, let's analyze this guy. That's a dark crawl. Yikes, what a ghastly looking spear thrower. Max HP is 20, attack six, and defense is zero. Wow, that's some serious attack power. You don't want to jump on it if its spear is pointing up, because that would hurt. For a run of those spear tosser, he sure looks like he's got a point to make. <laughs> Lucky for us. Let's clock out! Yeah! Time stop! Okay, with that done, we got at least three turns. So let's make use of it. Plus, I get to show off the move. We gotta make the crowd bigger. Plus, we fulfill the requirements. Plus, it makes it easy. Damn, he hits for six! And this fight's over. No biggie. That was not pretty. I'll give it that. We got ourselves a winner, the Great Gonzalez. We did it, Mario. Wow. Here's your fight money of 20 coins. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Um, Mario, your pocket's beeping. Mail time. Go to the telephone booth out on the pavilion. Oh, it's from X again, huh? Telephone booth? Pavilion? Does he mean outside? You remember seeing a phone booth? Well, we better go look around. Alright, so now we're rejuvenated. We're set. Let's go. Yeah, I'll end it here and we'll continue. We'll what? <laughs> Gonzalez. Good timing, you pudgy little punk. Uncle Rockhawk's got some advice for you. If you keep stealing the spotlight from me, you're going to enter a world of hurt. 
Quit making such a splash if you value your puny life. <laughs> hey, who does that guy think he is threatening us? But wait, threatening us? Maybe that haymail came from Rock Art. But one way or the other, we need to be really careful from now on. You're right. Let's go. And yeah, that is going to be it for this. Next part, we'll finish Chapter 3. And I want to make sure I don't spend too long making these videos. I always have them be an hour. I know a lot of you guys don't like this, but hey, I do what I have to do at least. So anyway, that is it. If you enjoy it, like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell. I will see you when we finish Chapter 3. This is Mega Man NG signing off. Peace out.